All right, so we out here in Taiwan on our flight back. There was some stinky ass kids sitting next to us. So, you know, damn well, I got to drop a YouTube video for you guys. And our first stop on the trip is Taichung. There's actually going to be three videos to Taiwan. It's going to be Taichung, Kaohsiung, Hualien, and then Taipei at the end. But this was uh, Taichung main station. It was cute. They had little art exhibits and they had a little JJK pop up on the side too. And then this is the park that was outside of our hotel and it was super beautiful. There was little structures everywhere, beautiful like greenery and cute pads everywhere. It was awesome. Our first day we slept in for like 14 hours. So this is our second day now, I think. And we're actually at this place eating beef noodles. So we're chilling at the Chen Shui Tang. I think I, I'm totally butchering that name, but I think it's the OG boba spot that made boba, but we're not at the actual OG one. Uh, we're here in Taichung, but we're at the uh, Civic Civic Park one. Uh, so far we've ordered shrimp shumai, some deep fried chickens, classic spicy tofu, spicy wontons and chili oil, some braised beef noodles, and also some, uh, some milk teas. So we're gonna see what's up. All right, so they were actually out of the spicy tofu, but we did get some beef noodle soup, the spicy, uh, some beef noodle soup, the fried chicken, the spicy wontons, the shrimp shumai. I got a hot osmanthus boba and some regular milk boba. And goddamn, it's hella good. Mm. <clears throat> got some tendon in here. Nice and bouncy, nice and salty, super savory. And the meat is just so soft. <clears throat> but we also got the chili oil wontons. And I was kind of dying because there's hella pepper in it. <laughs> but. They are so good. And also this fried chicken was like, kind of came out of nowhere. I haven't had the shrimp shoe mine just because it just came out. But let's give it a shot. Me struggling over here. Oh, it's cute. Mm. Mm -mm. Mm. It's like a little sweet. Aerate it, warm it up, driving up that top note. I'm like bouncy and you can't even taste the records. Super good. There's actually like little bobas in this osmanthus tea. And it's actually super good. Like it kind of tastes milky, but like still flowery or floral. And then the, the the, the pearls are actually smaller than they are in the U.S. Something else that's different in the U.S. is going up and <clears throat> ordering the food and paying for the food beforehand. And we went to a restaurant yesterday and we completely forgot to do that. Uh, and so that waiter was like kind of helping us. And I was like, but he said it in a weird way when he Google translated it. So it didn't make sense to us. And so he had to help us. But now I think we know what we're doing. But we also got the OG Boba here. And this one's super good, super refreshing. So here we're at Taichung Civic Square. That's the park that we went to for this place. And we went to Park 2, that's right next to it. And our plan was to go up to the National Museum of National Natural Science. And we took like a little kind of park, like road that goes all the way down. But we went on a Monday and apparently a lot of places like that are closed on Mondays in Taichung, which we didn't know. So we got there and realized that everything was closed and we were like, damn, who's this dude running from? Um, but we still made the most of it, went back. Uh, and on our way back, we actually went to McDonald's here that you'll see in a sec. And yeah, these are the. This is actually the hotel, the park outside of our hotel, and with the Bellagio fountains and the kayaks that we didn't go on because it was raining. 
But here, we're at McDonald's, of course, we had to. Americans, we gotta see what's different. And all of this is in new Taiwan dollars, so not actually USD. So you know we had to get McD's with the spicy grilled chicken barbecue burger, some little wangs, little crispy chicken salad, you know, Parmesan burger. Let's get it. It's the Parmesan burger. Mm. That one's pretty good, actually. My big ass wants some ch chick or some cheese on it, though. Mm -mm. And this one's hella good. This one's like nice and tangy. Let's try these. The flavored chicken wings. I don't even know. Mmm. Mmm. Hella crispy and juicy. We also got sweet tea and that one's really good too. Got some McDonald's already. Fuck it, clog my arteries. Let's get some ice cream. So we ended up pulling to Miyahara ice cream too. You get one free topping and I chose the little pineapple cake on here. And I also got the Sunday version and not just the waffle cone, but I, also, I got the uh, pineapple, Taiwan pineapple vanilla ice cream. Mm, it's hella good. It's got little chunks of pineapple in it. I don't know what this is though, like this little green thing. Mm. Oh, it's like a, it's like a kiwi sorbet, actually. But let's try this real quick. It's okay. It's like a little shortcake looking thing. Hmm. The butterfly is good though. It has like, it's like a cookie. It's like those cookies that you get in the round tin box. Yeah, really good. Everything's overall been super good on the trip. That was super good. So juicy. Mm. All right, give me your first impressions. We're here at a night market and we just got some fried squid garlic flavor. It's good. It's good? A little crunchy. Oh uh, yeah? Yeah, but like in a good way. Let me get some. Let me get this. Oh shit, shit. my bad. <laughs> All right. Mmm. Oh, yeah. This cooks pretty good. Mmm. Pretty tender, hella garlicky. Nice and flavorful. Yeah. Threw some seasoning on there when he tossed it up, so it's pretty good. So we got some chunky boss chicken and it's a fat ass cutlet. This shit is huge. And we got it fresh, uh, but in the meantime, when it was cooking, we also got some takoyaki over here, but let me get a first bite. Mmm. Mmm. Juicy. Hot. Mmm. Mm. We got the spicy flavor and it's so good. All right, so we got some takoyaki. Uh, they asked me for wasabi sauce, but I just keep saying yes to everything. So uh, I've never had it with wasabi on it. I hope I don't die. They also asked me for seaweed or bonito flakes on top and I ended up getting bonito flakes just cause it felt right. Um, they also put cum on it. 
I don't know. That looks hella weird. Doesn't look like mayo. Just looks like cum. Uh, so let's see how bad I burn myself. Thankfully, they've been chilling here for a while since we were eating that uh, chicken cutlet. But no, it's pretty good. They're just definitely not like as crispy as they would be because they were just like chilling in the little uh, takoyaki pan and then they like put them over to the side to like crisp them up, crisp them up a little bit. Pretty good though. Good morning, y'all. We out here uh, by Miyahara Ice Cream, waiting to get picked up by a little bus because we ordered an excursion to Sun Moon Lake. Uh, it's like 8 a.m. And I think I read the thing and it says the bus is actually getting here at 8.30 now. So <clears throat> yeah, we're here extra early, extra bright, but uh, Gonna go to Sun Moon Lake today and go see what's up. It's actually the first fucking sunny day we've had this whole trip. Like there's not a cloud in the sky. And the whole time we've been here, it's been like super cloudy. So I'm hyped that we chose this day to be able to do it. But uh, look at all these little fishies in the pond. Oh, you can't even see it. It's too reflective. Oh, maybe you can see that one over there. There's a couple. Hi, Nikki. Hi. Now we're pulling up to Sun Moon Lake this bus kind of destroyed me a little bit because it's like winding roads going up but nonetheless it was still beautiful still fun still worth it listening to my audiobook the whole way didn't take too long but we initially are going to Wenwu temple everyone on the tour went there and it was super beautiful it was super awesome like the architecture was super cool a little bit about the temple it was built three times Initially, it was in the middle of the lake on a tiny island, which you'll see here in a second. And the Japanese flooded it to create the water reservoir. And so they rebuilt it again. And then an earthquake destroyed it after that. And they had to rebuild it again. And that's what we have now. But yeah, that was the little island right there. So I thought I was also gonna be nauseous on the gondolas, but it actually ended up being fine because there was some air coming through. And oh my God, look at this. This was super beautiful with the cherry blossoms on the bottom. We didn't even know that there were gonna be cherry blossoms until we asked our tour guide, where can we see cherry blossoms in Taiwan? Cause we came, we went in the middle of March. So it was perfect time to see them. And then he was like, oh yeah, we'll see them at the next stop. And I was like, what? So it was super beautiful, super sick. The gondola ride was actually super long. You couldn't even see the end there. And so we ended up going to this little town on the edge of the lake where we ate some food first and walked around in the town a little bit, got some ice cream before we got onto the ferry, as you can see here. And this ferry took us like maybe 15, 15, 20 minutes to the other side of the lake where we were able to rent out a tandem bike for Nikki and I. And it was electric, so that was great. I wasn't dying. And we just rode it across or on the edge of the lake. And it was amazing, super beautiful, such vibes. Nikki didn't pedal for shit, for shit but it's okay. <laughs> This is our, this is our little horsey. What do you mean by that? That we've been riding on this little trail that goes all around. 
a look at the view we stopped at. How cute. What you know about chilling on a motherfucking bike? <laughs> All right, let's get it. Let's get it. Oh, I'm fast as fuck, boy. I'm fast as fuck, boy. You don't even know me. I'm fast as fuck, boy. We are here at Thang Cha Night Market. I ended up getting like this bulbous fruit. I, for I forgot what it was called. I'll throw the name up, but. Mm. Whoa. That's super tender, super sweet. Mm. It tastes like, it tastes like mango, but like, Super good. Alright, so I ended up getting the rice sausage sausage thing. <laughs> hey yo, what the fuck? That bitch hot as fuck. <laughs> it's good though. The red sausage on the outside is pretty good. And then, like the meaty inside one is like sweet. The one on the outside is more texture. It has like a, it's like pickled mustard greens or some shit in it. And there's something else too. All right, we got these sweet potato balls. Sweet potato balls, give me your honest review. It's <laughs> not what I thought it'd be. Um, they're good. They're not as like sweet potato-y as I thought. They're crunchy. They look pretty doughy. Yeah, I feel like I'm not getting the sweet potato flavor as much as I want it. But they taste <laughs> Alright, let me try these sweet potato balls. Yeah, it is hella airy. Yeah, you hella taste the sweet potato. If I knew there wasn't sweet potato in it though, I'd be guessing. Being like, what is that? But it does taste like that potato-y flavor, but sweet. <laughs> good hella crunchy they came out relatively fresh i like it they got the little dog he was just out here running he scared the fuck out of us it's his bar though 